My name is Ben Knowles from East Coast Yacht Sales and I'm on board the Serena 88. This boat has just completed at the factory, made its way to the con boat show. And after the show, she's actually headed to Florida to her new owners. But I wanted to give you a walkthrough tour of another Serena 88 that's headed to the US just so you can get a sense as to all the different ways you can finish off this boat. But please take a look at this video. If you have any questions for us about the Serena 88 or any other model, feel free to reach out to us using the information below this video. So we're gonna start our walkthrough tour with the salon area. I'm gonna give the team a little bit more time to finish up the exterior detailing before the show. But you've got this very large door headed into the salon area. And these folks have chosen to have this beautiful U-shaped seating area here with some movable furniture as well. These windows drop down completely behind the backrest, which just opens up this whole space very, very nicely. And similar on the starboard side, you have the storage cabinetry uh, off to starboard and this huge window that drops below the cabinetry. And you can even with this opened area, you can even get a good look, better look at the water, the way that they've designed all this. And every 88 has been a little different. Um, that's why we, I like to do tours of any 88 I get on board, just because there's a lot of personalization available for this boat. Lots of details and lighting in the headliner. Lots of different ways to set up this dining area. Look at this beautiful centerpiece of artwork here. You've got a huge opening window off to port and similar off to starboard as well. So you can be indoors and have a sort of an El Fresco dining experience if you wish. Headed into the galley, you've got two large deep dish sinks here refrigeration space. There's refrigeration peppered all throughout the boat, um, but you've got dual uh, drawers right here. In addition, of course, to a very large refrigerator in here as well. Trash right there, dishwasher, oven, induction cooktop, great amount of storage above as well and even have some nice hardware like this, just to take advantage of all the storage space available. Now we'll walk forward on the starboard side. This is access to the pilot house, which we'll take a look at in a little bit. And then you've got your day head right here. So your guests don't have to go down below. And then forward here is your on deck master cabin. This cabin is beautiful. It is, there's so much natural light. The fact that you are on the same level as a living space eliminates the need for lots of up and down on the boat. You've got this beautiful TV with plenty of storage, similar to port, hanging storage, but look at the space that you have on this master cabin. It is unbelievable. And this master cabin is particularly special. Not only does it just have a on-deck master with tremendous amount of space, natural light, beautiful head. Look at this stall shower in here. It is a very accommodating, large stall shower right here with just plenty of natural light. I mean, if you're on the anchor, you just, you have all these windows to enjoy being outside on an adventure. But 
you also have direct access to virtually a private deck forward on the boat. These owners have chosen to have a hot tub up here. There are many different ways to personalize this space, uh, depending on how you as an owner would envision your usage of this space. But you can have seating here. You can have this be a whole U-shaped, beautiful gathering area. Obviously these folks have chosen a hot tub. You can do a dipping pool and whatnot, but this is a nice private terrace access directly from your master cabin. But we can head back down and I'll take you, show you what the other living accommodations look like. And it is impressive. So heading down into the hall. Aft. You have a full beam VIP stateroom, and you've got two VIP staterooms on this boat. I mean, really, you can consider yourself having almost three master style cabins on this Serena 88, which is incredibly unique. Um, you can invite your guests over, you can have joint ownership with both owners on board, and no one feels as though they could have a lesser cabin because this is absolutely beautiful down here. The stonework is elegant, lighting details, fixtures. Beautiful stall showers. Nice recessed TVs. And off to starboard, or off to um, left for a starboard here. Sorry, I got a little disoriented. It's such a large boat in here. Um, you've got your laundry room in here. You can also have some laundry in the crew quarters as well. Port side guest cabin. naturally with a ensuite. It just doesn't feel like Serena is trying to do too much in this interior. They've got so much volume to work with on the 88. You can have these five staterooms on board the boat and not feel like you're trying to do too much with the space. Take a look at the flybridge. Here's the raised pilot house here. This is where your captain will be running the boat primarily. There is a helm station on the flybridge as well, where you as the owner, you may choose to run the boat there. Um, but huge amount of information you have access to with screens, video cameras, data on the ship, navigation you even have a, a place here if your uh, captain and crew are running the boat long distances um, and your crew can sleep here on their off watch if they wish and then headed up to the bridge of the boat this bridge is just so impressive. It is so, so impressive. You've got your helm station here. Huge stid companion seats off the port. If your guests want to enjoy the view as you buzz along the coastline. And then incredible entertaining spaces here too. refrigerators, ice makers, drawer storage, propane grill here. Again, this is a brand new boat headed to the US after the show. Lots of counter space. I love these stools here at the bar. 
and then aft. These owners have chosen to have seating back here. You can do a hot tub or, or anything. This is really a space where you can personalize the boat to your preferences. And another dining area to starboard, but just such a huge, huge flybridge. I love this area. But now we'll start walking through and do some of the exterior areas. Um, as you can see, this is kind of an asymmetrical uh, side decks on the 88. On the, the port side here, you've got this low wing station. So your captain, if docking on the port side, they can use a yacht controller and have excellent visibility docking this boat from here. And then if you move forward, you have a sunbed area here, very large. And then this is the owner's private terrace. Notice you have storage underneath the combings here. There's no such thing as too little storage on a boat. And now we'll walk aft on the starboard side decks. And you've got your steps to get aft from here. through the salon. Now the primary access to the crew quarters is off the uh, port side, side decks. This is a secret door to get you down below. This also gets you to the engine space as well. But you've got a little galley area for your crew. So refrigeration, you can even have a little table that pops up here and have a stool so you can uh, have some dinner if you'd like. Again, brand new boat, uh, so I um, still haven't fully uncovered everything, um, but um, crew for two over here. And then you've got your captain's quarters right here. And then you've got a stall shower and a head as well. So pretty nice area for the crew for sure. Garmin screen here so you can monitor ship systems where you're at. And of course you have your door to this beautiful, I mean, this almost feels like a medical room. Um, you've got, everything is bright and white. You've got this great tool box right here and, it, and some more areas to wash your clothes. V12 man engines, 1800 horsepower each. I'll get you the stats on fuel burn, economy, range, and all that on this video here, just so you can see those numbers. Dual Kohler generators on either side. Serena does an impressive job just with the sound insulation throughout the whole boat. There's floating floors, floating ceilings, just insulation all through the hull just to make this boat, boat particularly quiet. There's some of your fuel systems here. Very nicely laid out. Gosh. And then aft, this is your beach club back here. The door is closed, but you can still get access to the, to the engine space from aft here. And with this door opened up, you've got a beautiful beach club. I hope you enjoyed this walkthrough tour of the Serena 88. If you have any further questions about this boat regarding pricing, specs, different ways to finish off the boat, please do feel free to reach out to us using the information below this video.